Um, where was I going with that? Oh, I'm making a salad tonight. <laughs> That's about all I got. Heyo, welcome to the vid. I am very tired. I went to bed last night at about two in the morning. So, I feel a little deprived on sleep, but I made the book that I needed to make, and I'm up in time to go to work. I don't think I'm going to be late, I should be on time. Uh, I did forget to brush my hair, so that's kind of kind of all over the place, but that's okay. And I, oh man, it kind of feels good because I feel like I'm done doing stuff with those photos for now. I've got to make CDs, but that's not going to be until another, I don't know, week at least. So I'm gonna go, go to work. Oh my God, I'm talking in circles. This makes no sense. I'm just gonna get going to work. You'll see me when I'm done. And I'm done with work. Hump day is over. Well, not the whole day, just the work part of it. Um, it looks like it's over though, cause it's so dark out. Oh, I hate it. I still hate it. Um, daylight savings time. It's not fun, not fun. Uh, I am gonna go home and find myself some food. I'm trying really hard not to eat out or buy any food this week, just just trying it out. I spent 60 bucks on groceries, so I'm trying to use them, and so far, it's working out. I'm gonna go home, probably make some chicken, and I don't know what else, but we're gonna go try. So for today's dinner, I am having some eggs and salsa. Mmm. And I'm also cooking some chicken. This chicken is going to be used for my salad, that I'm going to have for lunch tomorrow, that I'm going to prepare tonight. <laughs> Meal prep, ugh. I was kind of running a little late this morning because I went to bed at 2 a.m. and it was very tired, so I had a hard time getting up. Anyway, I didn't pack any lunch until I woke up and I was like, crap, I told myself I wasn't gonna buy lunch this week. So I went in here and I grabbed whatever I could find and I found that weird like bulger, bulger, whatever. I don't know how to pronounce it. It's some sort of like wheat something. Anyway, microwavable, wasn't bad, wasn't great, but it was lunch and free, sort of. I had it, so I didn't waste any money that I haven't already wasted. Um, where was I going with that? Oh, I'm making a salad tonight. <laughs> That's about all I got. I don't really have any um, thing to do today, which is great. I feel like for the last week or so, I've been busy editing photos or making that photo book thing, but now I just kind of get to relax tonight, which is great because ugh, I'm getting worn out. I think I have too many jobs. Too many jobs, but I like doing, actually I take that back, I don't like doing all of them, but keeps me busy, keeps me busy. The eggs have been eaten, and I also watched the first episode of 30 Rock. So I've watched like episodes on and off of 30 Rock with Tina Fey, and I've never actually watched from like start to finish, so I'm going to start that series because I finished watching Skin Wars last night. <laughs> oh, my life is so exciting, I can't believe I make this video for anyone to watch that cares because it's not that exciting. But I'm going to try and make tonight productive since I don't really have a lot to do. I mean, that's a lot. I have so much to do. And it's going to start by doing the laundry. Yeah, I just washed my laundry. However, it hasn't made its way out of the dryer yet. It's been in the dryer for like two days, maybe three. I don't remember. Um, but my clothes have just been sitting in there and they're definitely wrinkly by now. So. Here's what we're going to do. Clean towel. I'm just gonna get it a little bit wet. Then we're gonna come over here to the dryer and we're gonna dry it with the clothes. And hopefully when it's done, my clothes will be wrinkle free. Now that the clothes are in the dryer, I am going to probably watch another episode of 30 Rock probably edit a video and then one thing I've been meaning to do for a while is clean my email inbox my personal emails because they're getting kind of unorganized and there's a lot of junk mail that's being sent to it right now so I'm gonna unsubscribe from a bunch of random things that I get and just try to clean it up so I can use it for real things <laughs> real things like I do anything with my life It has made its way out of the dryer. Now I just need to put it away. <laughs> I don't feel like it. Uh. I did get a chance to go through my emails though. So those are clean. My inbox is minimized. And I also, fun fact, just purchased, well, I didn't really buy anything. I just paid a friend who purchased uh, 
Mm, didn't really buy anything. What is, oh my God, what am I trying to say? Me and some people are planning on going to Colorado and probably going skiing in March, I think. So that'll be fun. Uh, yeah. That's all I got to say about that so far, because honestly, I don't really know. It's kind of a thing that I do along for the ride. Get it? <laughs> but I don't really care too much about where or what I do. I mean, in general, I do. But uh, when people plan trips, you know, like, they can just plan it. It's very rare that I argue for what I want. Well, that sounds weird. That's not what I meant. I'm usually adaptable. I will adapt to what other people want to do. So if somebody wants to ski, I'll ski. If somebody wants to go to the pool, I'll go to the pool, you know? So when there's a lot of discussion on like what hotel we're staying at or where we're gonna go and it's like you know what you guys decide let me know what i owe you and let's do it so that was my take on the event planning <laughs> don't get me wrong i love event planning just i don't like arguing and putting more work and discussion into things that i'll be happy with whatever the outcome is so i'll let someone else do it <laughs> okay time to put this stuff away and just like that, all of the clothes are picked up, folded, and put away. Now I think I'm going to go to bed. What an exciting life I live. What an exciting life. <sighs> I wish it was more eventful. But in reality, this is, this is it. This is what you get because this is what I do. Work, come home, eat, sleep. That is kind of the summary of my life. I wish it were different, but it's not. Uh, anyway, it is definitely time to get to bed. So do what's right, and you will see me tomorrow.